in this video I want to talk about when you go no contact with a person or people say it's your family okay um, that would make it easier for me to talk about as it's people okay anyway more than one is I meant but say you went no contact with your family but there is you know maybe one or two that you do have contact with but not that often anyway this did not happen to me but is something simpler to do. simple similar to oh what? what's going on with me but something happens and you need to go to whatever it is and they are going to be there okay it could be something good or something bad you know how it goes with family and all um, and it's not about them you know, to, this is how you're say, telling yourself you know this it's not all about them and you're not gonna let them ruin it whatever it is you know make you feel guilty or whatever if you didn't go or or you do really want to go and whatever you know but you are in no contact with them and so you have it all set in your mind that you're going to go go there with the whole doing the whole gray rock thing you know, where you just don't give them anything don't let them get to you and Ooh, I can't barely see. And so you have it all, you know, you've rehearsed how you're going to do it and everything. Okay, whoo, that sun is something else. I had to click it off because part of that down there, I couldn't even see the street light. Yeah, it's pretty bright. It's the sun, right? My eyes, you know? Okay, maybe now I'll be able to see. Whoa, that was something else. But anyway, where was I? <laughs> so, I was talking about you're all ready to go gray rock to whatever it is that you're having to go to and those family members that you have gone no contact with are there okay now this could happen and it's kind of happened to me before in a different way though this this story is kind of hypothetical and fictional but you go there and you know it's a lot of people there or you know a group not just them and they let everybody that who's there know this is how they put it they, they let them know that they have gone no contact with you okay yes they switch it around on you and say that you know they don't put it that might not put it that way that they've gone no contact they might say that they disowned you or something but they're going to turn it around and everybody there you know tell everybody they went no contact with you okay so I'm just saying this in case you know you are going to have to go through that and you need to know you know just keep that in mind that that could happen you know, I'm really not here to give anybody any counseling advice because I'm not a healthcare professional provider but I'll tell you I wish somebody would have warned me <laughs> because what when it happened to me it was like I don't know, um, maybe two or three, two years ago or so, and uh, yeah, they, they, it wasn't in person, it was online, it was my family, and they kind of let everybody know that they kind of disowned me, <laughs> it was like, really now, seriously, yeah, so, but for me, I mean, I was so, uh, I guess I've been through enough, you know, and processed enough and everything that I didn't really, uh, let it get to me you know and but it was kind of you know at, at that moment I had to stop and think well what should I do and what should I think now, if somebody else had told me I would have been kind of forewarned and I would have already thought about you know how would I handle that kind of situation if it came up now you know some people say that that's a bad thing when you try to figure out how to handle something when it comes up but I don't I don't know about you what do you think anyway this is a short one leave a comment below this video on YouTube y'all later or just blow